Hi everyone, it's Jessica with the Foothills family here on YouTube. Today I'm going to share our latest Walgreens haul. These items were purchased at 50% off. So it was 50% off by five, get one free and at at least 70% off maybe even a little bit cheaper. All these items were purchased for Operation Christmas Child shoe boxes. We share these videos in hopes that maybe you can also find some of these deals at your local Walgreens as well. So first I found this Hot Wheels Shark Launcher. It did come with one car. You can see it launches out of the shark. So really cool on sale for when I bought this for $2.99. So if you can find this in your store, it might even be cheaper now. That same day, I found a couple of these Disney Princess Fun Topper pins. So they're like gel pins. Princesses and Mrs. Teapot and the Fairy Godmother and Flounder from the Little Mermaid and they're double-sided. This day I purchased two of these and at that point they were on sale for $2.99. And then the next items I found was this really fun notebook. You can see the little eyes of the kitty are shimmery and they're, they go up and down and it's almost like a little stuffed animal. And this notebook was on sale for $1.99. And what I like about this, here comes my cat, <laughs> Hannah. And what I like about this notebook is it kind of comes in like three layers. So you've got this first layer of little blank notes, cat's face. And then there's the second layer and it's hard to tell, but there's little fishes on there. And that's what the pages are, or fish. And then the third layer, it's really shimmery, like a really pretty iridescent. And that actually has little kittens and it's lined. So I thought that was really cute for $1.99. On two of these little Cinderella notebooks, it's a little bit raised. The first layer, I don't know if you can tell, but it is actually like a, a picture of Cinderella. It's the same that's on the front. And then the second layer, is a really pretty again that shimmery almost like an iridescent and it has little blue roses and flowers on it and then when you open it up you can see it's got pumpkins on it that's cute and then the third layer is the castle and then it has pictures of the carriage on it and here comes our my kitty again <laughs> <laughs> so that's all I got for the 50% off sale. So they were buy five, get one free as well. So I went ahead and got some of these items that I knew that I wanted to get because you just never know if it's going to be available when it goes even more clearance. So next I'm going to show you what I got a couple of days later when it, the toys went discounted even more. So at my store, there was a sign that said the toys were 70% off when I got these. However, when I got up to the register, they were not ringing off 70% off. They were ringing off 50% off. So the cashier had to actually modify it herself. It was really busy and I didn't really pay attention to what all she was doing. I didn't check my receipt till I got home. So some of these items are a lot more clearance than others. Obviously that's probably not going to happen in your store. It's still a good deal if you're able to get these toys for 70% off. So I do want to show them to you. First I found this rainbow scratch art notes and it is 125 mini notes and it comes with one wooden stylus and this came up a dollar 20 and this is a melissa and doug item i've seen a couple people haul this and this was something i'd had my eye on i also found this this came up 36 cents 
and it's one of those slow rise squishy pins which i was really excited about because i'm going to put this in my peter rabbit box next i found this game now this is not going in the shoe box i just wanted to share in case you're also looking for ideas maybe for the children in your life so this is hasbro battleship card game ages seven and up this came up for 75 cents and i did get one more of these princess toppers and these actually came up this time 90 cents found this cat globe spinner and you can see a lights up when you push the button and spins a little fun kitten on there and this came up for one dollar and five cents you can see on the bottom it's got some little kittens playing with yarn i got this toy um this was the one that i don't think she rang this up correctly up for 70 cents so i don't know what happened i'm just counting that as a blessing um, it is Little Tyke's Bath Time Give It a Squish Spinners Twirl When You Score. Question is, to, is do you think this is something I should put in a shoebox? It does have little suction cups on there. You can see right here. I mentioned before that our church also collects for a backpack ministry where we um, each year donate. So I'm wondering if this might be something better for a, a backpack instead of going in a shoebox. So let me know your opinion on that. I picked up one book. I really like the colors. Really a cute little book. And this book actually came up. It was actually the most expensive item. It came up for $2.70. Foam letters and numbers. I may actually be giving this to my youngest. My little tykes, by the little picture, it just sticks on to the side of a bathtub. And this was 90 cents as well. The items that were at least 70% off was eight dollars and 16 cents i did have a little bit and actually one more dollar of walgreens cash i was able to to use to redeem and that is all that is all that i was able to get at walgreens oh so i know they're still having 90 percent off and you may still be able to find some of these items for at least 70 percent off in your store i love when you guys share things with me and share your tips and encouraging words if you want to leave a comment on this toy if you think i should put this in a shoebox or a backpack for a local child in our area please let me know i hope you all are staying safe until next time god bless hey guys anna and i wanted to share about our instagram page if you're not a Remember, we would love for you to come over to Foothills Family Packs a Shoebox on Instagram. There we talk all things shoeboxes. For example, I just did some stories on why I open all our surprise and mystery items like this, why I never pack them unopened. So if you'd like to find out more, come on over to Instagram at Foothills Family Packs a Shoebox. Love to see you over there.